when we hold fast to the notion that our job is to supposed to give the path that is sure and true and the advice that is unchangeable, we are actually not at taking care of our clients. We're not taking care of our children. We're not taking care of our spouses, our significant others. We are trying to assuage our own fears and our own insecurities and our own uncertainties. Oh my goodness, if I show up and tell people I don't know what to do, I have my own fears, then they're somehow not going to believe me. And time and again, what I hear, what I hear, what I experience, what I see is the opposite. If you falsely convey the feeling that you don't or attempt to convey the sense that you don't have your doubts, you're going to destroy the most important currency you have with your clients, which is that sense of trust. Now, there's a critical distinction, which is this is not license to project your anxieties onto your clients. Your job is to sort of say, yep, I am unsure, and that produces a lot of fear for me. But again, here's what I have known, that for 95 years, the markets have gone up. Past performance is no indicator of future performance. Right, but it raises the probability 